Welcome back to our tutorial series on mastering the Red X Dex app. In this episode, we're diving into the cut list, material list, and exploring the 3D model to better understand the structural integrity of your deck design. First up, let's reveal the joist labels to see how our deck is coming together. By pressing the Manage Layers button, we can hide the deck boards, allowing us to view the joist labels clearly. Scrolling down, you'll find each joist label corresponds with the cut list, detailing the label, quantity, material size, and length of each component. To view the labels for the floor beams, we'll open the Manage Layers panel once again and hide the deck joists. This reveals the labels for the deck beams, neatly organizing your plan. Similarly, by hiding the floor beams, the post labels and locations become visible, providing a comprehensive overview of your deck's foundation. Moving on to the material list, it's divided into four sections, floor joists, floor beams, beam posts, and deck boards, ensuring you have a complete list of materials needed for your project. For convenience, the app allows you to export the cut list as a CSV file with a simple press of the blue export arrow, enabling you to save and share your list effortlessly. Also, you'll notice the deck area and perimeter indicated just below the material list. Now let's explore the 3D model, a powerful feature that brings your design to life and helps visualize the loads supported by posts and footings. At the top of the screen, you'll find buttons to change the camera view from left, right, front, back, and top, as well as a button to toggle between 2D and 3D modes. Switching to 3D mode, use one finger to move the camera to the right side of the deck. Zoom in on a post by using two fingers and tap once on the post to display its length and the load it supports. To navigate around in 3D mode for a better perspective, use two fingers to move the camera in any direction. Tapping on a footing reveals critical details like the pounds per square foot being exerted on it, along with its width and depth measurements. Stay tuned for our next video where we'll cover how to save, print, and share your deck design.